What is up, guys? I'm back, and uh, a couple of things have happened. Uh, I trained my Pokemon. As you can see, they are all level 19, except for this Shroomish, which uh, I taught it Flash. And uh, that's a good thing, so that we'll be able to get Steven after uh, we beat Duford. Um, Alright, Ralts is 19, Lombre is 19, and Combuskin is is uh, 19. Now, uh, Combuskin evolved, and I uh, did not uh, record it in a walkthrough, but uh, I recorded it during Life Smarts class. And uh, I have the video clip, and uh, it will be played at the end of this video, at the end of this part. Uh, it will be at the very end. So if you want to see uh, Torchic evolving a Combuskin, then uh, yeah, just stick around for the end, and uh, you'll hear my life uh, smarts teacher talking and all that shit. Uh, yeah, so anyway, yes, I play Pokemon in school. All right, so uh, I think we're good. Uh, so yeah, let's go, or no, let me stock up on some potions. Is there even a freaking Pokemon in here? In this damn town? No, over here, man, no. Well, I don't see one, so... Fuck this, man! Let's just go straight for the gym. Oh, boy, now I'm gonna have to play the damn gym like this, so let's talk to this guy. He has a going champion bound Reaper. Do for gym leader Brawly. Commands fighting type. Ooh, Brawly, not Broly. Brawly. Going against him with normal type Pokemon is added for trouble. Fighting Pokemon will lay a serious smackdown on normal Pokemon, so be careful. What's worse, the gym is as dark as the ocean floor, but it will get brighter after defeating the trainers in your way. Hey, go, okay. Hey, okay, go for it. Alright, so this is perfect for Ralts, uh, since Ralts is Psychic, and we all know Psychic is super effective against fighting. So this is, uh, very good. Very, very good. Alright, so I'm gonna start with this side here. Uh, yeah, I won't be the one crying at the end of this battle. BITCH! Ooh, Meditate. Alright. So let's go. Ralts is going to completely dominate. There, confusion. Oh. Alright, won't do much. Uh, let's see. Uh, what is Meditite again? Uh, I don't even know what Meditite is. Like, I've searched them up before. But uh, I like I don't know like completely what he what he is. Maybe it'll say it in the Pokedex. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm actually gonna search for him in the Pokedex. So after this, I will see what he is. He kind of looks like a psychic Pokemon, but uh, he might be fighting. I I don't I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea. Uh, Wow, uh, so yeah, so yeah, didn't I, didn't I say you were gonna cry at the end of this battle? I told you that. I specifically told you that. Uh, let's see. Doesn't even tell you, like, what the Pokemon are? Like, I don't think it tells you what the Pokemon are. Like, look. Uh, cry, uh, it's not in here. It's not in there, either. Nah, man, nah. Nope. Alright, whatever. On to the next trainer, wherever this person is. There we go. Oh, it's a double battle. Fuck you, man. Fuck you. So, a sailor and a battle girl. Hmm. Let's see, uh, another fucking Meditite, man. Why? I hate those damn things. Alright, so obviously I'm going to use Confusion on the matchup first. Uh, matchup. And, uh... Oh, yes, Nature Power. In, uh... In that damn cave where we, uh... Where, where I was training at? Uh, where I told you I was going to be training at in the last part? Nature power turns into shadow ball. Oh my god. So sick. I think I might actually keep shadow uh nature power for a while. Cause that is just Man! In caves, it's game. It's game. 
Alright, so let's use Confusion. And, uh, how about Absorb? Let's see what happens. I didn't do much. Probably should use Nature Power. Yeah, see, I knew it. I knew I should use Astonish. I knew it. See, I was, I was debate. I was contemplating whether to uh, use Astonish or not at the get go. But uh, I, I saw an Ancient Power there, and I was like, hmm, let me see what this turns into. And then I completely lost track of. Uh, uh, I was gonna use Astonish. I completely forgot that I was gonna use that. All right. Uh... Alright, so this what happens when you go up here? Let's see what happens. Uh, I think Brawly is up here around here somewhere. Yep. He's right there. We don't want to fight Brawly yet. I want to take out every single trainer in this damn gym. Hey, I'll, extra XP. I'll take it. I'll take it. Ralt is gonna evolve soon into a curly uh yes. Oh, uh, okay. A critical hit. I only have one potion and a super potion, so Ralt, you got you kinda gotta hang in there. Uh and Metatite is confused, which is a good thing. And that reminds me, like I I don't know if Metatite is psychic or not, but like just something like here check this out it, it kind of reminds me of something how like usually like i don't know how to say it but like how does a fire pokemon get burned how does an ice pokemon get frozen how does an electric pokemon get paralyzed like how does a po poison pokemon get poisoned like these are the things that i don't understand that happens to me in battles sometimes on pokemon showdown it just it's, I don't know if it's because it's Pokemon Showdown or if that's how it is. Because I could have swore it happened to me when I was playing uh, Pokemon Pearl 2. So, like, I, I just don't know how that happens. Like, wouldn't, wouldn't like, the Pokemon, ab like, I know that it's an ability to, like, absorb. Like, if somebody uses uh, the same move with the same type you are, uh, you absorb it. I know that's an ability, but like, wouldn't you just automatically absorb it? Like, or it will do nothing to you? That's the, like fire moves against fire moves. It, it it should just not do anything. It's just like I can understand if you're fire and like something else, but if you're just playing fire, then fire shouldn't do anything. Yeah, that's always just been my theory of it. You know, like. What do you gotta do to a water Pokemon? Freaking drown this shit? It's a water Pokemon. How the fuck are you gonna drown a water Pokemon? It's just like it's just like certain things like these, man. Just can't do it. Uh, and this is perfect. I'd be getting a whole a shitload, a shitload of XP for this. Like I'm I'm calling three hundred. Oh no, 241. And that barely did anything. See, Ralt is just so hard to level up. It took me about half an hour to level him up to level 19. So two levels, it took half an hour, which is not, you know, like horrible, but it's not good either. But yes, and speaking of Pokemon Showdown and OU, uh, one of the most common Pokemon I found are is a uh, uh, are Genesect, and um, yeah, Genesect are pretty good. I mean, I have no experience, or I have little, little experience with 
the uh, Unova region, like I, Unova region, like I beat the first gym, and that was probably all I played. So maybe about nah, 50 minutes, 40 minutes. So yeah, I don't really have much experience. I don't really know the Pokemon in there, so I can't really say anything about it. I mean, I, of course, I know Zekrom and Reshiram. And I know Zoroark, and I know the starters, Tepig, and, uh, you know, just, I know that stuff, but, like, all the other Pokemon, I don't, I don't know shit about them. Uh, so, let's go up here. And, yeah, here we are. We, uh, I think we're gonna fight Brawly now. So, uh, let me, uh, heal my roll. Should I even heal this thing? No, I'm not even gonna heal it yet. Uh, and here he is. I'm Brawly, dude, for gym leader. I've been churned in, churned in the rough waves of these parts, and I've grown tough in the pitch black cave. Well, that's where I train, too. So you, wanted, so you wanted to challenge me. Let me see what you're made of. That you will, my friend. You will see. Uh, let's see his first Pokemon. A match up. This thing should... Get one hit KO'd. Nah, I don't know. It should get it should get to at least like red or something. Uh, so let's see, Ralts. Show me what you got, man. Let's go. And it got the yellow. Wow, that's bullshit. Uh, defense rows, attack rows. That's one down. Two to go! And thank god Ralts is gonna level up! Thank you! Ralts is going to evolve! And we got a fucking meta tight. Fuck that shit. I'm sending Lombre and fuck that man. Goddamn plate on his fucking head, man. I, see, I've, I mean, I've seen this thing so many times, but. Jeez. Wow, things look thing looks if you look closely a thing looks like a freaking tactical nuke Oh um, my if you ever played Modern Warfare 2 And you've seen a tactical nuke symbol like the freaking triangles and shit on that looks like a fucking tactical nuke man Jeez. Ooh, Okay, okay Lost its focus and couldn't move. Well, why the hell would you try to use focus punch? The hell? Are you crazy? Only a retard would learn that move, and that's bull. That what? 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 No, man. Nah. And here we go with the fucking potion shit again. Ugh. The gate. I swear, the game cheated just so Brawly could do that. The game fucking cheated me. And here he goes, focus punch bullshit. Uh, and he flinched. Alright, so hopefully, uh, he doesn't have another super potion. And he does. Alright, well, he's out. He's uh, he's clean out of potions. So that's a good thing. And I think I'm about to run out of Astonish. And, uh, let's see. I have Fake Out, right? Is Fake Out a dark move or normal? Yeah, normal. Alright. Because... <laughs> Uh, what's the one I'm thinking of? Sucker Punch. Yeah, I'm thinking of Sucker Punch. Sucker Punch is uh, a dark move. Alright, so, uh, I guess I'll just use, keep using Astonish. <sighs> and speaking of Pokemon Showdown, uh, previously when I was talking about Pokemon Showdown, uh, if you, like, completely, like, own somebody, or, like, I don't know, if you beat them, and, uh, you know, or if you get beat by somebody, and, like, that person writes GG in the, uh, chat section, 
Um, I th hope it stands for good game because in my forum, uh, GG means good going, and that means like see you later, you suck, see ya, game over. Uh, but hopefully they mean good game. But when I write GG, like if I completely own somebody, I write GG. I mean good going. I mean you suck, I wrecked you, see you later. That's what I mean. Makuhita. Oh boy, I hate fighting moves. I hate freaking Machokes and Pearl with their. And that. I don't know, like. With Revenge and Vital Throw and that type of shit. And like Diamond and Pearl. Oh my gosh, that shit pissed me off, man. That shit pissed me off. Vital throw. See, it's... Alright. Oh, well, Rolls, you did it, man. You won. You did it. And to top it all off, you're going to evolve into a Curlia. So let's go. And I defeated Brawly. Who looks nothing like Brawly. Oh, wait, wait, whoa, whoa. That hair kind of looks like Brawly's a little bit. Even though he's much, much uh, scrawnier, that hair kind of looked like Broly's. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Wow! 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 A ballet dancer! Curlia. Uh, so let's see what this kid has to say. Oh, I got the knuckle badge from Brawly. Hmm. Yeah, that's surprising. Uh, knuckle badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30. Even those you get in trades, obey without question. And you'll be able to use the HM move flash outside of battle. If you like this technical machine too, obtain the TM08. I swear there better not be some retarded shit like bulk up or something. Uh, oh my god, wow! Every time it's some retarded shit. Fuck you, man. See you later. <sighs> well, look at look, look at Reaper walking out, walking out of the gym like a champion. Look, look at that! What a boss! Such a boss, man. Anyway, I'm gonna heal my Pokemon, and that will probably be it for this part. Next part, we'll uh, we will uh, rescue the Steven kid they speak of uh, in the cave. So, stay tuned for that. And uh, stay tuned for uh, Blaziken Evolving. So, uh, let me save the game here. Alright, see you guys later. Stay tuned for the next part. Oh, yes, and uh, while I was training in the cave, I uh, came across a couple Sableye. And uh, I decided not to catch them because they were females. But then I came across two male Sableye. The first one... I tried to catch, so uh, I put out uh, Blaziken because, you know, Psychic doesn't affect, or Confusion doesn't affect the Sableye. So I used, uh, I put out Blaziken and I used Ember and uh, one hit KO, critical hit, fuck that, man. So uh, the next time I uh, encounter the Sableye, I, uh, I use Peck, right? And uh, I get it down to, uh, you know, pretty much maybe one-fourth of the way. Not one half, not a yellow, like one fourth of the way. So I'm like, okay, uh, I can do this. So one more hit, and I'll get it to yellow, and I will uh, catch it. So I hit it, critical hit, done. I said, fuck that, I'm done, left that cave. Anyway, see you guys later. Rackstone Reaper, signing off. Take care. The position, if it has a title, this would be in food services. And then you want to talk about your skills. To utilize my communication and cooking skills. And then you can talk about the industry. So I use three of the four. So that would be your job objective. 
If the damage is still underneath objective, we're going to put, anybody remember what comes next? What comes after objective? References are at the bottom. Next thing would be education. Okay, so for education, you type education, tab over to the next. We want to start splitting this. Okay, we want to split it into two rows. So make sure this cell is highlighted. Go to your inspector. And then from the inspector, it says edit rows and columns. And then go to the little gear looking thing. And we want to split rows. So now that row is split into two rows. Okay, so education, we have one big cell. The next note, we have two rows. So we're going to split it into two rows. Okay, with this first cell still highlighted, we want to split it into three columns. Okay, so we're going to go back to edit rows and columns. Go to the gear again. Split columns. Okay, split it into two columns. We need three. So now we only have two columns. We want to split it again. So you're still in one of those cells, and then split columns again. Okay, we have three columns. These two are much smaller. Don't worry about that right now. We're going to space it out later. So you'll have three cells and one cell. Everybody good with that? Okay, for education, in that first cell, we're going to put your expected graduation date. So it's 